it applies for the job for you. I wanted to follow up with the first video I put out about me losing my job as a federal contractor. And I wanted to show you or just tell you what I've been doing, what apps I've been using, what websites I've been using to apply to jobs. So stay tuned for that. I, before I lost my job, I've always used Indeed. I've heard some horror stories from different people. I'm not sure if it depends on the area that you live in. I live in a very, uh, I live in a career driven area. So I've never had really any issues when it came, came to Indeed. My first federal contracting job was through Indeed and every job since has been through Indeed. Haven't had any issues. Of course, I've been rejected from jobs and have done interviews and not gotten a job. That's happened. But as far as being scammed of it being a job, saying it's a job, but it's not really a job, I've never had that issue. So I guess take this with a grain of salt. So Indeed has been my main source of how I've been receiving interviews um, and finding different jobs. And then I've also just gone to different website, websites, different companies, maybe where my friends work or um, I've done the public school systems in my area. Those are a little tricky. Um, so just different websites. Of course, I have searched through LinkedIn. LinkedIn hasn't always been helpful for me, but I do plan on maybe purchasing the premium plan just to get more insight. So with that being said, I also wanted to show you guys this new app that I've been using and it's called Prep AI, P-R-E-P-A-I. And this app, app so far has been amazing. I've only been on there for about a week or so and so far so good. So what this app does, it applies for the job for you. This app is like a dating website, right? You swipe left if the job is not for you, you don't like the job, you don't like the salary, um, whatever it may be, you swipe left. And if the job is for you, you swipe right. But it only makes sense to swipe right if you have uploaded your resume and your personal information. And so that's what I'm going to show you right now. So we're going to swipe left and just go through some jobs that we do not like. And right now I don't see any jobs that I like. So I'm going to go to the top right of the screen. And it's like these three little lines. Um, and that's where you will go to filter what makes sense for you. So at first you'll see at the top job titles. So you just put in job titles. I'm going to put in like administrative assistant, program assistant, program analyst. Um, executive assistant, things like that, right? So then you scroll down and you can scroll and see the companies that you might like. I'm not going to put a company. I don't want to limit myself. So if you would like to put a company, put a company. Next, you'll see the area location. So it already has United States. So that's fine, you know, and then you can also add your states. And I'm not going to add my states, but you add your states. That'll help, okay? So location. And then you scroll down and you'll see um, if, you, if you want it to be a remote job, hybrid or in person, and you select those. It'll be helpful because a lot of these jobs are all over the place. So just put remote, hybrid if that's what you like to do. And then what kind of job, if it's a contract job, full-time, part-time, freelance, all of those things, all right? <clears throat> okay, so then there's a spot for you to go to profile and then you will select that and then you will add your resume. And once you add your resume, that is how you will then be able to swipe right. But now I'm just going to show you how you would pay. 
Um, so this is a fee and this is not an ad at all. I don't get paid for this, as you can see. <laughs> um, but you, it is uh, $9.99 for 50 jobs a week. So, yes. But if you're in desperate need of a job like I am, you will find a way to pay that. Um, because so far, so good. You know what I mean? <laughs> um, I've already... So there was a glitch with my app and I've contacted customer service. They did respond the next day, um, gave me some steps to walk through. So now I'm just waiting, but I have already applied to several jobs. You won't see it on here again because there was a glitch, but I've applied to several jobs on here already. I've gotten rejected by some, some applications don't go through. And I think that just has to do with the website and the application software some of these job sites use. Um, I think that's just what the bottom line is with that. And then I've also been invited for an interview for one. So, so far, so good. So I just wanted to give you guys an update on how I've been looking for a job. Maybe this is helpful. It's called Prep AI. You can use Indeed, LinkedIn, always use your resources, the people around you. And while you're waiting, there's something in your hands to do. I'm sure of it. And use that. You never know where God will direct you. I just want to show you what I was using to apply to different jobs. And so I hope this is helpful and I will talk to you guys soon. Bye guys.